No fewer than 165 Nigerians arrived at the Namdi Azikiwe International Airport Abuja on Friday at about 11.50 p.m. from Budapest, Hungary. They were received by officials of the Ministry of Foreign Affairs, Minister of Humanitarian Affairs, Sadia Umar Farouk, officials of the National Emergency Management Agency and Nigeria in Diaspora Commission, amongst others. On arrival, the returnees who were provided are expected to meet with the health officials for medical checkups thereafter they would proceed to fill some document after which the sum of $100 will be given to them as part of the $8.5 million approved by the federal government for the 5,000 stranded Nigerians in Ukraine. Some of the returnees shed light on their experience. I got injured. I sustained a lot of injuries. My leg, I had to, I was limping for like three, four days and like we we didn't we didn't get a shower for like about four or five days. I feel good, great, happy, thankful that I am safe. Nigeria government came through for us. They kept checking on us, so it gave us hope that we could still survive it, and we did. The airlines within the next few days are expected to evacuate over 2,000 Nigerians, mostly students from the war-torn country. So far, 757 have been evacuated. The second batch of Nigerian evacuees from Ukraine earlier arrived in Abuja, an airpiece flight carrying the 183 evacuees with 180 adults and three children touched down at the Anamdi Azikiwe airport at exactly 6.35 p.m. on Friday. The evacuation exercise follows by Russia on Ukraine, which has left scores of people killed and many displaced. Favor Usaro reporting.